What's going on YouTube? Gsnow right here. So in today's video I have a great tutorial for those of you who want to pretty much remove the uncovered jailbreak in order to either start fresh and jailbreak again and have everything clean or to simply remove it forever and just not use it again because of jailbreak detection in applications and so on. Now if you're having problems with CDM and you know it gives you a lot of errors that you cannot seem to be fixing or if you just have too many tweaks that you want to get rid of this is actually a very very good idea and it doesn't require any SHSH blobs, it doesn't require future restore or even a computer, you will remain on the same version and all of your important user data will remain intact. Anything that is removed is pretty much the jailbreak data so that you can start fresh as if you've never been jailbroken before. Now the way we're going to do that is by using Uncover itself. Uncover jailbreak is actually very different compared to any other jailbreak in the history. This one allows you to pretty much remove it if you want to and it has a built-in feature for that. I think this is the only jailbreak with a built-in removal tool that actually does what Uncover does and that is pretty much using iOS against itself. You know, by using the uh, snapshots in order to pretty much return to a very clean state before the jailbreak. So in order to do that, in order to remove the uncovered jailbreak on iOS 12 with anything that it has installed like files and tweaks and themes and so on and start fresh, all you have to do is to make sure that you are not jailbroken, so reboot your phone if you are. And of course, go ahead in here on the settings and there should be a function called restore rootfs or recover. You have to toggle that on. We press in here and as you can see, it's now been toggled. And when you press jailbreak, it's going to pretty much run the exploit and it will clean up everything. Instead of jailbreaking, it's going to clean up the uh, entire jailbreak folders and files and so on. And everything related to the jailbreak will pretty much be destroyed so that you will be left in a state that would pretty much look like you've never been jailbroken before. So as you can see, I'm getting this. Notice, will restore rootfs. This will take a while. Do not exit the app and do not let the device lock. So at this point, it will restore the old snapshot and will make everything clean. So we press OK in here and it's going to tell me that it has been successfully restored and now the device will be restarted. After the restored, all your tweaks and all your themes and anything related to the uncovered jailbreak would have been removed and you are pretty much fresh again as if you've never run uncover before. So I'm going to press OK, it's going to restart and I'm going to be right back. So after the restart, the uncovered jailbreak was completely wiped so there will no longer be anything related to it except for these icons in here. Now the icons for Cydia or Falsa and so on that you have installed may still persist and they will not open, don't get me wrong, they have been completely erased, but they do persist in here. If they do annoy you, although they are completely harmless, you can go ahead and reset the device by going to settings in here and to reset. It's now safe to erase all the contents and settings. However, you should keep in mind that this will remove anything from your device, including your personal data. So if you want to go this route, you're going to have to first back up your device with iTunes or iCloud in order to avoid losing your data. However, if you do not mind the icons in there, these that remain, you may have Cydia for example, or Cydia and Falsa or whatever else you have in installed as an application in the jailbreak, then you can simply put them in a folder and leave them alone. Uncovered jailbreak has been uninstalled at this point and if you press jailbreak again, it will jailbreak and install everything back again but you will have absolutely no tweaks installed and no themes and so on. So you're pretty much jailbreaking clean again. So yeah, this is actually very useful if you have applications that do have jailbreak detection and you cannot use the uncovered jailbreak while you use them and of course if you want to start fresh in order to fix Cydia errors and all that jazz. Since we erased the jailbreak it will install Cydia again and it will fix the problems that you might have had. So yeah this is pretty much it. This is how you remove the uncovered jailbreak and all the tweaks installed and all the themes all at once and this is actually built in into the uncover. How good is that? So definitely worth a try if you do have problems or if you simply want to just start fresh. So yeah, thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe to stay updated. I am Geo Snow and till next time, peace out.